the fourth edition of CAVES, CAVES 2014. The team has been here already for a while preparing and now the astronauts arrive and when the astronauts arrive it's always a party. Everybody is excited and has uh, really is going 4,000 per hour because uh, when they arrive it's the time when we really start and we go for CAVES finally after months, months of preparation. <laughs> <laughs> the first thing that happens is that the team introduces itself and it's a very interesting moment when the astronauts meet explorers, explorers of different worlds. I'm uh, with NASA, I'm also uh, active duty uh, US Navy uh, test pilot for Roscosmos for Russia. Um, I'm a former engineer. I have uh, no experience with, with caving uh, whatsoever. Uh, and I have uh, one space flight. Uh, I'm an engineer, I have a PhD in material science engineering. <laughs> After this dream, I hope to be in better shape. <laughs> <laughs> we are ready, my name is Antonio. I actually work at ESA for the German Space Agency. Talk to and each other uh, and exchange experiences and uh, exchange also the enthusiasm of working and living together for a couple of weeks. Uh, that's a, always a very, very in intimate and uh, exciting moment, really. Then there is the equipment distribution. It starts, uh, there will be tons of things that have to be brought into the caves and the astronauts need to try on all their personal equipment. It's always uh, fun to see um, astronauts going around and trying on equipment of weird sizes. Uh, but it's very important for them to have uh, equipment that really fits. Uh, they will need to leave with that equipment and work with that and really be on safety for a couple of weeks. start with the lessons. So cars, they need to learn what is the environment they will be in. How do caves uh, form? How do they evolve? What are the caves they will be living with? Because they will also need to perform science, which is a very, very important element of cave. We, we have a very interesting science program and they need to start from the beginning to get familiar with uh, the equipment and the program and these scientists that they will work with. They learn photography. And then they start preparing for the moment when they enter the first cave, when they finally get to learn the environment that they will be living in. And it's an easy cave but it's a water cave, so it's also the moment to get fresh and to splash, to jump, to uh, get uh, kids again. But it's not uh, just that, they will also learn a little bit about uh, how the caves get formed through the water passing through the rocks. So it's a moment of learning and playing. And then they get to taste their food and select how much they will bring with them. That's always a very difficult choice. How much will they need? This is raw, but you can eat it that way. Uh, shredded duck breast. The, the quails and the duck. It's uh, a moment of discussion and then their team starts getting formed and they start getting ready. And tomorrow it's another day. Paxi, ready to go? Oh.